there's a heck of a lot that's been written about the complexity of helping relationships. And when, when you really look at what's involved in status issues, motivation, identity, uh, professionalism in helping relationships, it becomes pretty clear that if you treat an adult like a child, if you do your professionalism to them and you watch them and try to make what they do, it violates almost everything we know about the nature of effective relationships between adults. If we feel our job is to watch what teachers do and know what's best for them and not give them a voice and monitor every little thing they do because we don't have faith in teachers, we treat them like children. Just like we say, you've got to put your coat on before you go outside. We say, you've got to make sure you do the advanced organizer the way I said. And it's going to engender resistance. And we have a history of teachers resisting professionalism because they haven't been treated like adults. A helping relationships should be equal. It should be something that the teacher has a voice in. They should, they should set the goals. And so we really see teachers as partners in the process. That's what we want is where everybody leaves better for the experience.